So in this short video, we're going to discuss Mapleson breathing circuits. This classification groups breathing systems depending on the circuit position of the fresh gas flow, reservoir bag, tubing, expiratory valve and face mask. They are less economical than circle systems because fresh gas flow normally needs to be at least that of minute ventilation to prevent rebreathing. So just to start with, we can start each of the breathing circuits as so and then add the other features onto them accordingly. On Mapleson breathing circuits A, B and C, the expiratory valve is in this location here. And then on Mapleson circuits D, E and F, the fresh gas flow comes in at this point in the circuit. For Mapleson A, we have the longer tubing which exists in the circuit here, the fresh gas flow comes in here and the reservoir bag exists here. A Mapleson B circuit is different because the fresh gas flow will come in to the circuit here, the long tubing will be here and the reservoir bag there. Mapleson C is similar to Mapleson B but the tubing is much shorter. So you have the fresh gas flow coming in here and the bag exists right next to the fresh gas flow without any long tubing. Mapleson D, E and F can be described as T-piece breathing circuits. It's also worth noting that Mapleson A, or the LAC system, is good for spontaneously ventilating patient and Mapleson breathing circuit C, also known as the water circuit, is commonly used when there is a need to manually ventilate a patient outside the theatre environment. So now we have Mapleson D. Here's the long tubing. We then have the pressure control valve here and the reservoir bag as so. E is an Ayers T-piece and it's commonly used in paediatrics because it provides little resistance to gas flow. And then F is Jackson Reese modification of Ayers T-piece. And it's very similar to Mapleson E, but has the addition of an open-ended bag on the end of the circuit. The coaxial version of Mapleson breathing circuit D is known as the Bain system. And thank you for watching this video. I know some of the diagrams aren't too tidy, but I hope it gives an overview of the Mapleton breathing circuits.